Africa has probably assigned a baby to negotiate with IPOP over Biafran agitation. A report circulating on social media claims the federal government has assigned Ayinaya Eberebe, the Senate Minority Leader, to negotiate with the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP. The report also claimed that Eberebe rejected the offer and told the federal government that IPOP only wants Biafra. Facebook group like Biafran TV, Biafran Journal, Authentic IPOP News, Biafran World News, Indigo Press Team and Daily Mail GIST posted the claim. For instance, in one of the groups, Biafran TV, which has over 15,000 followers, the post has garnered over 597 reactions, 101 comments, and 86 shares. In Biafran Jonas Facebook group, which has 177,000 followers, the post has garnered over 839 reactions. 282 comments and 142 shares. A Beribe who hails from Abia, the same state as Namdekano, has always shown support for the IPOP leader. In 2017, the senator stood shorty for the IPOP leader during his trial for treasurable felony. Kano later jumped bail and fled the country in June. The IPOP leader was arrested and brought back to the country. In July, Eberebe said he will stand shorty for Kano if the need arise again, while stressing that he did not feel betrayed that Kano jumped bail. The support displayed by Eberebe to Kano has been used as a launch pad to create fake news in the public space. Now, they are now see Eberebe to be important, right? Well, whether it's true or a lie. The truth stands that Bwari wants a negotiation. Let me tell you the humble truth. Bwari is looking for a way to negotiate. To negotiate with the IPOPs, yes. But you don't know. Bwari is looking for a way to settle. But the only settlement that Bwari is asking for is a settlement that Biafran will never... We, we never even want to concur with. Biafra will never accept it. And a Eberebe has given Buari the answer of what Biafra really wants. Biafra freedom. So there is no need sending me. That is what a Eberebe is trying to tell him. A Eberebe is the mouthpiece of the Biafrans. He has been represented and he keeps representing. So you can see. So you can see how this is for this country is. You see that they already know that Senator Eberebe has been the mouthpiece of the Biafrans. Now they want uh, someone to speak to the to, to the Biafrans. They now know Eberebe. They have forgotten how they plotted against Eberebe. How they, they, they plotted his downfall. They called him all sorts of names, point accusing fingers at him because he was supporting the Biafrans. Oh, so sorry. It's not going to work. <laughs> uh, see, I only pity those who are still thinking that Biafrans will succumb and give it all to give it, give 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 away Biafran agitation. How possible is that? How possible? That's why I love the reply Eberebe gave to Bari. The reply Eberebe gave to Bari is a reply that. No need of sending me. This is what the Biafrans will still tell you that they need freedom. That is all. So, what what are you going to say? A Beribe is a Biafran. That is what he's trying to say to Bari. No need of me going to tell the Biafrans. I will say to you what the Biafran wants. That is what a Beribe actually means. So, my dear viewers, we don't need to argue much on this. We don't need to because we already know, we already know the, the, the whole thing. We are already aware of the whole thing. But Ari wants a negotiation. But what he's requesting is the least thing that the Bia France will ever accept. So he should just forget it. He should forget it. It cannot work. Is that not the reason why he plotted the repatriation of Mazin Abdekano? 
Now, this repatriation of Mazin and Kanu is what will now bring the, that very Biafran freedom. You understand? That very Biafran freedom. This repatriation is what will now bring it to pass. So, and it's not only going to bring the Biafran freedom to pass, but also it's also going to bring the freedom of Mazin and Kanu completely. So, our Southeast governors that are afraid of Nnamdi Kanu coming back to the Southeast, they will now see him coming back completely. Yes, they are afraid. They will not see Nnamdi Kanu coming back. <laughs> Quite interesting. I love this. I love this. You understand? Yes. You are sending a baby to go and negotiate with, with the Biafrans. No way. You see, what I've seen the possibility of Biafrans achieving their, 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 their freedom in this Biafran, in, the, in, in this uh, Mazen Amdekanus trial. We have seen it. That's why he's just indirectly, you know, thinking of a way out. Oh my God. Yeah. Quite interesting. I love this. See, it's a waste of time. I must say this to the president that it's a waste of time. You understand? It's a waste of time because there is nothing, there is nothing anyone is going to see about this. Because uh, after the trial of Mazen Namdekanu, Namdekanu will be given the opportunity to, to make a request. And that request that Namdekanu is going to make is no other request than to say that freedom should be granted to the Biafrans. Do you understand? Yes, that freedom should be granted to the Biafrans. That's what he's going to say. What else? What else? So I put this before any person out there that the period, the time for Biafrans to rejoice and celebrate has come. Has come. So whether Buari likes it or not, the Biafrans are going to make and get their freedom. They are going to get it. And the time for them to get it has come. The time to get it has come. So nobody is going to deny them of it. Nobody. I've never seen that person. Do you understand? And that is just the humble truth. So I really love the message that Biribi actually passed to Bori. He gave it to him exactly how the Biafrans are going to give it to him if a Biribi go back to them to pass the message to them. No, don't, no, 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 no need to think about it. It's a clear message, a very clear one. So Bori on his own should think about it himself. You think about it. Because when he was going after Namde Kanu, attacking Namde Kanu, he never thought about it. He never think about it. Now he is begging a baby. My dear viewers, don't think that it's a lie. It is true. Because even Bari himself is looking for a way to negotiate with Namde Kanu. He has been pleading. Have you forgotten how many times he sent top personalities? He sent, uh, 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 he, he, he sent uh, Oji Uzo Kalu. Audios of Kalu failed. He tried making use of um, Namdi Kanu's um, colleague, Uchemefo. That one was bought over. Eh? He used a lot of top personalities. Namdi Kanu defeated them. He, they thought that they can be able to win the heart of Namdi Kanu the way they won the heart of Adakabolo Buru of 1967. My dear viewers. The eagle's the eagle head has been has been broken. Am I right? Yes. Please, my people in the house, let us hear you and feel what you have to say about this. Um, please don't forget to leave your comments below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as bell button to receive more updates. Thank you.